Hey everyone, this is Thelman23 as you may well know. Uh, last time we did Baba's Tower, or Baba's Place, now we're going on to the next in the series. Yes, yes, we meet Pilaf again. And uh, yeah, let's have some fun with this, shall we? And uh, yeah, just keep going, just keep going. Uh, I'll leave uh, these guys to explain themselves. Ah, Mountain Dew Code Red, it's been so long since I've had you. Alright. They're promising to give me the Dragon Ball. If I can defeat them. And now they have created the Megazord. Okay, let's go. Alright. Um, yeah, this actually isn't that hard of a fight if you, uh, if you can uh, figure out the pattern. There's a small pattern, not really a big one or anything else like that. You just gotta kind of do whatever you can to do as much damage as possible. And uh, be aware of the uh, be aware of the uh, tracker one, as you can see there, and uh, those. Just gotta be careful with yourself and remember how to block. Blocking helps a lot. Uh, the um, the super, you know, the level 3 Kamehameha works pretty well. Um, so, yeah, just keep up and do a little bit better than I do here. Um, yeah. The, uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm doing really badly here. Not as badly as I could, rather, but still not great. And, uh, gotta hit the... That's one of the hard spots where I can't, uh... Ah, crap. Why? Why did I spin the wrong way? Alright. Now. Come on, come on. Yeah! Let's see if we can go for no continues this run. And, uh... Okay. Pilaf has been defeated. Alright. Come on. Yeah, I got all the Dragon Balls, and... Upa's father... comes back! Yay! Shenron! Yeah, um... I've got no reason to do that. That was actually just me being a geek. As, uh, some of you may know, I am one, so... Sorry. Um... Yeah. Now, we're going back to the World Tournament Arena. Here we go. All right, now, I love the World Tournament stage here, because you get introduced to my favorite character in all of Dragon Ball. Yeah, that includes Z, because he's the most badass character. Sorry, it's true. I mean, he, he even stood up to Super Boo and put up a damn good fight. And he gets introduced here. And this is Chiaotzu. Chiaotzu, not my favorite character, but he's not a bad character. He's just... He's the glass cannon of the crew. 
Yeah. Um, I know that makes a little bit of sense to some of you guys. Not a lot of you guys, but yeah. He is the glass cannon of the crew. He can't take a punch, but he will deal out good damage, and he actually ends up destroying himself more often than not, because he can self-destruct. Like, um... Think of him like Electro. Yeah. And, uh... Yeah, I don't do a very good job in this fight. I'm, uh... Very, very bad. And, uh... Bam. Smash. Come on. Six. I let that one go too soon. Okay, come on. Smash. Now, hit him. Ah, damn. I screwed up. Okay. Ow! Dote on Ray. Dote on Ray. Dodons are awesome. I don't care what anybody says. I like the Dodon more than the Kamehameha any day. And... Uh, bam. Nope. Almost done, almost done. Yeah, Chatsu's gone. And uh, this is where defense starts to play an uh, important role in your strategies. Um... Yeah. Second match. Versus Krillin. The matches got a lot better from last year. Jackie Chun's not the boss anymore. And uh, you don't have Nam, who ends up getting a bunch of water from Roshi. And you don't get... Um, you don't get Giren, who was awful. Come on, Krillin. Damn. Just go down. Just, just, just lay down. Lay down, Krillin. Lay down. Smash. Stay down, Krillin. Stay down, Krillin. Stay down. Stay down. Eh, he's not going to stay down. I still have no idea how to do after image. Goku should be able to do after image. Um, but I'm still doing Jenkin, and that's still a fun technique. Paper, rock, scissors. And bam. Yeah. Krillin went down. Krillin went down easier than Chatsu. And now comes my favorite character in all of Dragon Ball. Tian Shin Hong. Yeah. I love Tien. He's amazing. He goes from villain to hero in the most badass way. And it involves mercenary cyborg Tao. Yeah. You heard me right. Cyborg mercenary Tao. Revived by the Red Ribbon Army. And the sad thing is we don't get to see him in this game. And if we do, then I am absolutely wrong, and it's an amazing, uh, amazing thing, but, yeah, I'm just, I'm not sold on it. Because some of you may notice something is missing from Tian Shin Hong. Some of you have already seen Dragon Ball too, so. But yeah, Dragon Ball, amazing. Damn. And now, oh, I missed. And, 
Uh, he's starting to block now, and I'm starting to take damage. Yeah. Blocking is really, really impressive, but it's hard as crap to do. Play it yourself, and you'll understand. You gotta press back at the exact right time, and it's just... Uh... And come on. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Good. Yeah! And... Get up. Get up. Yeah! After image. I guess it's, uh... LB to do after image. After image is, uh... Something that I gotta start working on. Oh well. And... Come on. Jin, just go down. Just go down. Also, Tian Shin Han wins in the most badass way over Yamcha. And uh I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say it. You gotta look that one up yourself. Anyway. The uh the world tournament. Here we are. Here we go. Goku wins. And let's keep going, I suppose. He forgot a Dragon Ball and a Power Pole at the tournament arena. Yeah, that actually happened. Oh, also, Krillin died. Yeah. You ever wonder why Krillin owned is a thing? Right there. They also off-screen a bunch of other stuff from this. So, um... Yeah, I got Tian Shinhan as, uh character in fight mode. Anyway, if you haven't seen Dragon Ball, I highly suggest it. Highly suggest it. Go watch Dragon Ball. I, don't, I, I definitely won't mind. Go watch Dragon Ball. This will all have much more of an impact once you've watched Dragon Ball. Go watch Dragon Ball. It's so much better than Z. I mean, honestly, it is so much better than Z. Though it's full of the Akira Toriyama art style, which becomes... Oh, yeah, uh... Forgot my controls there for a second. I forgot I was trying to, uh, attack, but, uh... My, uh... My analog stick is what I had mapped. And I got used to it because I mapped it for everything else. And, uh, yeah, I haven't, uh... Yeah. I haven't gotten used to using the D-pad yet. And this guy. I know I should talk more about him, but he's not a hugely difficult boss. He's, uh, definitely a boss, but he's not difficult in the sense that most people would think. I had a harder time against, um, against Black, honestly. Because Black had more stuff that's just... It's definitely not that hard. It's, uh... He, he does have a few things that are just, like, non-blockable, which is fine, but you can... You can often just trap them in that, or fly under, fly over those, and uh, I, I kind of screw up here, so uh, that's just me. Uh. See, it's not entirely a difficult fight, I just made it hard because I kind of suck. And he, uh... Yeah. Poor Nimbus. 
And that really should have killed Goku. But then again, Goku... We know these things from, uh, from Z now. Goku being a Saiyan, getting the crap kicked out of him by everyone at this point, gets incrementally, incrementally better every time that he's near death. So, yeah, he, uh, even now he's stronger than he was, but that's looking back at it through Z, and Z doesn't really hold a ton of precedent in, uh, Dragon Ball. And this is... King Piccolo. The evil King Piccolo. And I don't blame you for not recognizing him if you only watch Z. Because he looks nothing like himself. But oh god, is he a lot better. I honestly don't think that uh, Z was planned to go as long as it did. Same with GT. I think that he planned to stop after the Cell Saga. And, uh, yeah, just look at that. Uh, I'm thinking of... I was thinking of, uh, stopping. But I, I got a look at the HP and I knew I was kind of dead. So it didn't matter. Yeah. Piccolo. I'm sure that, uh, you could probably win that in somehow, but... I can't do it because I'm not that good, so. He takes me to uh, Corrin's Tower, and we get a bunch of bunch more plot because they off-screen a bunch of things. Like Goku killing Master Roshi. Not exactly true. Him killing Shenron. Actually true! <laughs> Believe it or not, he killed Shenron after he gained uh, his youth. Him killing Master Roshi is kind of false, because Master Roshi got this thing, and this thing had to drain your life to try and seal evil away, so Master Roshi tries to use it on Piccolo, Piccolo doesn't get hit, and Master Roshi dies. And... Here's, uh... Yeah. Here's the real Mystic Water. And, uh, the first one was just training with Corrin. This is the real Mystic Water. So to have yourself, uh, to have your power unlocked. Which is wrong, but right, but wrong. There's so many things that unlock your power in the Dragon Ball universe. And this is where... I'm calling it. Good night, everyone. Hey, everyone. Did you like the intro? Uh, I hope you did. Anyway, I need a title card artist. Sad but true. The only way to get noticed nowadays is a bumper artist, title card artist, things like that. So that's what I want. That's what I need. Your art will be used. Your... Uh, outlets will be advertised so let me know hit me up uh i'll leave my twitter and everything else in the links below and if you like it good if you don't well hey what can i do right anyway i'll talk to you guys later